Before being able to use the new Match Fees tool, you'll have to configure this within your Shop and Payments dashboard. First of all, you'll be taken to the page here that says Get Started with Match Fees. You'll click Set Up Match Fees, and then you'll be asked whether all of your teams are charged the same amount or not for your fees. So obviously, if your players are all paying the same amount here, you'd click Yes. However, if you want to set up different amounts for your different teams, you'll click No. You'll then be asked to give a name to your first set of match fees. So in this instance, we're going to call this one the Senior 2020 to 2021. And then you'll be asked to add in the price variations for your match fees. Once you've popped in those amounts and the different titles for those amounts, you'll click Next. And then you'll be asked which teams will use these particular fees and this setup of those fees. So if you click add teams, you'll be taken and you'll be shown all of the different teams that you have within your club on the right hand side here. Select the teams that are relevant to these particular fees, save that option and then click next. You'll then be asked if there's any other match fee sets that you'd like to set up. So here, if you've already created one for your senior teams, you might want to create one for your junior teams, which is what we're going to do here. So we'll click add another option and this time we'll call this junior 2020 slash 21. You'll then click next again and be asked to put in the different pricing variations for the junior fees. Once you've filled those in, click next. And then again, you'll be asked to select all of the teams that they apply to. Once you've selected those teams, save that and click next. You'll be taken through to be shown whether all of your teams have been assigned their match fees or not. If everybody has been assigned, you can click finish setup. Or if there's teams still missing, please go through and add in the other options for those other teams. Once you've clicked finish setup, that is all the teams ready to go. And you'll be ready to start assigning players and using your team selections to build players accordingly.